Hello, I'm Robert. I will show you 11 body exercises to reduce stress. Why only to reduce stress? It's because stress may be important in your actual situation. Stress can help us to be faster, to be more awake or to deal better with pain. If one of those aspects is important in your actual life, you have to dose this exercises. You can dose the exercise by shorting the time of practice. Instead of 20 or 30 seconds, you make it only 10 seconds or you skip this exercise. You can choose the exercises which give you the best benefit. You can make it for yourself and you can make it in groups. Stand for a moment, feel your feet, move a little, breathe, sense your body and then you can start simply to look around, moving the head, moving the eyes. Looking at the corners, if there is a spider. And just for around about 10 seconds, stop it. Stand, feel your feet, sense how was it for you. And let it express your thumb, how was it? Was it fine? Not so good? No. Find the right position of your thumb to evaluate how it was. Was it good? Then you can make another 10 seconds. Perhaps it was enough to go to the next exercise. It was not so good, so skip it the next time. The next exercise is good for making it groups. It's about yawning. <clears throat> Relax these muscles. <clears throat> and if one person is yawning, uh, it's more easy for the other person. <clears throat> If you have difficulties yawning, <coughs> simulate you are yawning. <coughs> Breathing and making sounds is fine. <coughs> okay, then stand, sense your body. <coughs> Express it with your thumb. How was it? And then give words to how it was. Ah, it was pretty nice. Yeah, no, I don't like it. And like the other exercises, if it was very good, make another 10 seconds. If it was not so good for you, skip it next time. Again, standing, sensing the feet, breathing, sensing my body. And then I'm rolling back my shoulders. Like I'm putting down a backpack. And breathe. And you can make sounds. There may be so many things to put down. And again. Yeah. And then standing there, sensing the body. How was it? Breathing. My thumb can express it. I'm looking at my thumb, how does it 
express it. Uh, for me, it was fine, but enough. And it wasn't very fine. You can repeat it. You can make another 10 seconds. If it was bad for you, skip it next time. The next exercise is pretty powerful to reduce stress. So dose it. You are aware of your situation and how many stress do you need. Okay, I make loose fists. I bend my knees, I bend a little forward and I hit the outside of my thighs and of course I go on breathing. Okay. Some people don't like to hit themselves, so you can skip it. The other persons, yeah, are worth it. Let your thumb express it. For me it was fine and I'm finding words expressing it loudly. It was fine for me. I would go another 10 seconds with this exercise. And you know, perhaps it was, was enough for you or perhaps you are feeling you better skip it. It's, it's fine. You are sensing how it is for you. The next exercise is about the knees. Sometimes in high stress, we are tending to freeze. This happens, this exercise is very important. It's about straightening the knees, locking the knees and unlock the knees. Lock the knees, unlock the knees. And I'm going on breathing. Locking, unlocking, locking, unlocking. You can do this in many, many situations, many occasions. Waiting in some where it's a very important exercise. And you can sense how you feel, or oh, is it in your body? Okay. How was it for you? For me, it's great. I like to practice it every day, sometimes. Okay, and give, give an expression loudly. Say, ah, it was fine. No, it was not so good for me. Express it loudly. Here comes another exercise, very effective to reduce stress. So dose it according to your situation. It is moving the knee, lifting the knee, moving it towards the elbow. And you can make a noise, you can breathe out. And sense your body, feel your feet. Keep moving a little. How was it for you? Do you like more? Do you like to skip it next time? Express it, say it loudly. This exercise is about chest, belly. You can tend, in stress times, you can tend to this. And then it's good to stretch it. So I'm stretching my belly, my chest, 
lifting my arms, breathing inside my chest, opening my chest. So I'm standing. How was it for you? How do you feel inside? If it is good, you can make another round, you can make it longer. Perhaps if it was enough, or perhaps you will skip it next time. Sense it, express it. Say it loudly. Another exercise for our shoulders. The shoulders tend to be very affected by stress. Okay, here it is breathing in. I am lifting my shoulders, breathing out. I drop them. Okay, it's an understanding, sensing, breathing. How was it for me? How was it for you? Nice, but enough. It was very good. Make another round. Or skip it next time. The next exercise is about the feet, wrapping with the toes. You can make it in one side, on both sides. Feel how it is. How is it making it in one side, then in the other side? on both sides and then stop how was it do you like more of it do you like to skip it next time it's your choice this next exercise is a little more difficult to explain it's about pelvis floor and butt Try to get a certain tension there. And you can make it like you are rotating the legs outward, giving a tension in the backside, and then pressing legs together at the same time to tense up this region of the pelvis floor and breathe into it. The sphincter you can also um, activate. And then let it go slowly. But maintain a certain tension there. Okay. You have to sense it more inside than that it is visible outside. How is this for you? Express it with your thumb. And say loud. Yeah, very nice. Oh, no, no, better I will skip it. It's your decision, your choice. We are coming to our last exercise. It's good to close the whole exercise to make it to finish these exercises. It's about not to get freeze, it's about getting in movement. So 
it consists in starting to walk, clapping your shoulders, clapping your chest. And it is good if you can express something loudly to speak out things like, I survived, I made it, I'm fine here. And of course it, can, it has to fit with your situation. But get in movement, move, move, sense your movement, clap your shoulders, express what you have survived.